Hello all, this is Mahi. Welcome to Study with you Mahi. In this video, we are going to discuss about the scheme Kanti Velugu. In the context of Telangana government scheme and policies, the scheme was launched by the CM KCR on August 15th in 2018 in Malkapur village of Tufran Mandal which is present in Medak district. Malkapur village, Medak district which aims to conduct free eye examination for the people of the state which aims to conduct free eye examination and the scheme was also launched on the same day at Marikal village of Mahabub Nagar district by the then governor Narsimhan. Narsimhan is the first governor of Telangana state. Next, Chief Minister K. Chandrasekhar Rao decided on July 21st in 2018 to start a program like Kanti Velugu and which was launched on 15th August 2018 on Independence Day. The scheme was launched to create a avoidable blindness free Telangana. To create a avoidable blindness free Telangana. The government has decided to undertake universal eye test to all the people across the state. Across the state, the scheme was launched under the name Kanti Velugu. As a part of this program, the causes of vision defects are identified, medical services are provided and also spectacles, medicines are given to the patients in the free of charge. And the objectives of the scheme are to create awareness among the people about the prevention of harmful eye diseases, about the prevention of harmful eye diseases and to arrange free surgeries and other treatments which are required. To operationalize Kanti Velugu scheme, 799 teams have been formed with 940 medical officers with 1000 optometrists and around 8000 staff. And these teams will look after 250 people in rural areas and 300 people in urban areas per day. And next, achievements of the first phase of Kanti Velugu scheme are more than 1.5 crore people were tested of whom 55% are female and the 45% are male. More than 1.54 crore people were tested and among them 16.6 were SEs, 11.02% were STs. And this data is very much important for group 1 exam. They might ask in the sentence formations. And next coming to the scheme. 25 lakh people received reading glasses and another 20 lakh received prescription glasses. And the program Kanti Velugu is successful. It served its purpose by reaching out to the state's most vulnerable citizens and helping them to overcome preventable blindness. And considering the success of the first phase in 2018, the government relaunched the program on January 18th in 2023 in the Kammam district. First phase was launched in Medak district. Medak district and the second phase in Kammam district. This time the government proposed to complete the program in 100 working days by deploying 1500 teams in gram panchayats and urban local body. And that's it for this video. I have covered all the most important points which are required for the Kantavelagu scheme for the group 1, 2, 3, 4 and other exams. If you haven't watched the Manavuru Manabadi scheme, please do watch. I'll give in the end screen of the video. And also watch Satavahana dynasty, Ikshvaku dynasty, Vishnukundis dynasty videos. I've completed the Satavahana dynasty, Ikshvaku dynasty and I've started Vishnukundin dynasty. I've given introduction and the political history of Vishnukundin dynasty also. And next, I also made the videos on important days of Telangana and eminent persons of Telangana and their titles and some important current affairs of March related to Telangana. And also I have started the series on Telangana Jatras. I have covered more than 8 Jatras and I will cover the remaining Jatras also. Please do watch those videos if you haven't watched and subscribe the Study With You Mahi channel. Like and share the video with others also. Thank you.